Arjun Marwariya, the snub of what Sayyid Zafar Islam is saying is that everything that could have been done to take care of the patients was done. Nothing was left unattended. Everything that could have been done to help those who were injured was already being taken out, taken care of. So why blame the Prime Minister? Yeah, I am just asking your question and uh, also the Jafarul Islam. See, the, you know, the uh, incident have been occurred at 6.40, day before yesterday. And I was the first, uh, you know, the political person to reach at this spot and so oversee the rescue operation. Now, 1, 1 a.m. midnight, till midnight, no, you know, government machinery reached over there. Till midnight, I am saying. Till midnight, almost 100 dead bodies have been recovered and uh, you sent to for to the post-mortem. Uh, Rahul. And uh, over, uh, uh, till morning, almost all, you know, the dead bodies have been recur recovered. Uh, the rest of the 10 dead, dead bodies recovered, you know, the, in the daytime. So, uh, administration have not reached over there. And chief minister was not there in their daytime before, uh, you know, the yesterday. They were attending the political rally with the prime minister. Okay, and let me go across to Rina Gupta as well. I, before I, I go back there. to Zafar Islam, on the Here issue of I earlier the opposition demanded that Rahul, the prime minister go I was, uh, I was there, to Morbi. Now when he has gone to Morbi, again you are finding Nobody fault with his presence over there. there. Surely when the prime minister comes, Everyone has to pay extra attention to what's going on and there is that much more care given to the patients because the Prime Minister himself is coming to ask each of the patients how they are doing. Why is the AAP so upset? Rahul, it is a sad and tragic day in the democracy of this country where 150 people have been murdered. And I say this with a great responsibility. These people have been murdered because of corruption and because of this, uh, this lackadaisical attitude of Bharatiya Janata Party, if anybody needs to introspect, it's Bharatiya Janata Party. Yesterday, when all these people were in the hospital, their health minister was seen making merry, having fun, celebrating his birthday. So the only persons who need to introspect are the Bharatiya Janata Party leaders. And now what they're trying to do is they're trying to whitewash this incident, do Lipa Poti. Why is it that Nobody is holding accountable the higher officers of this Oreva group. The MD of the Oreva group, who brought limelight, inaugurated this hospital. The, you, the uh, No, the no, but what makes you think he won't be acted against? They've already said everyone guilty will be acted against. He's missing. Yeah, and from Rahul, what we know, authorities yes, yes. are looking for him. Rahul, there have been 22 SITs which have been formed in the last five years in Gujarat. Who has been held accountable? When the people who should be held accountable, the urban development minister, who is also the chief minister of Gujarat, the people who are in the SIT report to the chief minister. So you have to be naive if you are expecting an impartial report out of this SIT. What we want is uh, an inquiry by a retired Supreme Court justice. We have seen in Gujarat time and again, SITs are formed. You know, when there was that uh, fire incident in Surat, SIT was formed. Who has been held accountable to date? Nobody. In the 100 people who died in the Hoots tragedy in Gujarat, another SIT was formed. Who was held accountable? Nobody. I, I ask on your channel that the Chief Minister of Gujarat should have resigned by now. It is the Urban Development Department that should have made sure that the bridge was not opened. If there was no fitness certificate, the whole, whole town of Morbi, and Morbi is a very small town. Everybody knew that the bridge is open. So many people gathered there. The Nagar Nigam did not know. The police did not know. How is that possible? The MD of, of this group did a huge opening ceremony with his granddaughter, where a lot of senior BJP leaders were present. So what Bharatiya Janata Party is doing, it is trying to protect now, these people. Now, 